Good morning, everybody. My name is Jonathan Fortney, and I'm the IT specialist here at Praetorian Labs. Today, we're going to go over how to install the software for your Dymo printer. First thing we're going to do is we're going to go to your browser. We're going to go to Dymo support .dymo com. And the most important step in this process is to make sure that you do not plug your printer into your computer before you finish downloading the software. And when you get here on the left-hand side, you go to driver and software downloads. And if you look at the lid on your Dymo printer, you'll be able to see what model Dymo you have. So right now we're working with a label writer 550. So we'll go to label writers. And then you're going to select your operating system. So we're going to select Windows. It's going to pop up a window where you can save where you want to put the software on your computer. We'll hit save there. In the top right hand of your screen, you're going to see this arrow. If you click on that, it'll show you the downloading progress. Once it's fish finished downloading, you can double click it. Might take a second for it to load here. You may need admin um, privileges to do this. So if it doesn't let you get a hold of your IT specialist at your company, we'll hit yes. Select your preferred language. Preparing to install. So Dymo Connect Install Shield Wizard will pop up. We'll hit next. Read through the license agreement. I accept, hit next. This is just where you want to save it again. We'll hit next. Make sure that complete is highlighted. Hit next. And we'll hit install. This may take a few minutes, depending on your connection. Okay, now that your install is complete, we'll hit finish. It should open up the Dymo Connect application. At this point, you can now plug in the power to the back of your Dymo printer. And you can also plug in your USB from the back of the printer to your computer. After you plug in the cables, you can hit the on button on your printer. You have multiple dymos. You can select this arrow here and it'll pop them up. And then you can select the one that you have Plugged in, it'll automatically detect what size labels you have in there. So make sure you hit yes so that your sizing is correct. And then you hit print and it'll print your label. If you have any difficulties with this, you can call the lab or your account manager and we'll help you out. Thank you. Have a good day.